yo what's up Tots? my name is Warren Potato and today we are back and today we're going to be talking about some crazy stuff um, that will be added into the final version of the one and only Attack on Titan Freedom Awaits alright hey but before we start the video scroll down like and subscribe you don't know how much it helps me and how much I appreciate it so do it it only takes three seconds and thank you so much let's get back into the video all right now that we got that out of the way let's hop into the juicy stuff that we got so for our first thing we have that there is going to be a story mode and uh, possibly other modes and progression inside of attack on titan freedom white okay now if you're wondering where i got this stuff from i got this from the developers um inside of an actual stream that they did a while ago uh maybe three days ago yeah i think it was three days i didn't hop into it because i was too busy and then i was late so yeah you know how that works but anyway the big deal is that there's going to be a story mode inside of this actual game so with that i'm pretty sure we can conclude ourselves that we're going to get bosses based on what happened in the show okay so for every event there was so many events um if you don't want anything spoiled i recommend you just click off the video um it's not huge spoilers or anything but yeah I would, if you don't want to get spoiled at all just click off the video but there's gonna be things for the huge events which are like um maybe helping aaron get to the wall with the rock on his shoulders and stuff like that and um fighting the female titan fighting the beast titan maybe even i don't even know fighting reiner when he was over the wall you know um stuff like that there's going to be just little moments in the story where we have to actually just imitate and complete those which is going to be really really fun because as much as attack on titan freedom weights looks good and the graphics are well um all the mechanics are nice they have to make something else to entertain us because just killing titans all day for no reason isn't fun but if they add a story mode and some events we can do that over and over and over and over and over and maybe even different modes such as like maybe kill killing spree mode i forgot what it was called but it's a mode where you just keep going and going and going until you die you know stuff like that like this infinite titans they never stop until you die stuff like that just little cool game modes that we can have fun together maybe had to have a leaderboard stuff like that so there actually is there's already a leaderboard in game for like kills but leaderboards for other stuff you know all right now the next thing we have is that attack on titan will not be a free game at first it will be free game eventually but there are so many stages that they actually have to go through to actually put this game in the right place that they want it to be so with that being said the game will not be free after the demo there's going to be pre-alpha there's going to be alpha beta all that stuff like that so just be prepared for those stages because they the game is most likely not going to be free at that stage but then eventually it will be free so hopefully that doesn't last too long if so we'll just have to bear with it i'll make sure to make you guys videos from the inside because i'll 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 pay for access so you guys can watch so you can see what you're up against in the future but yeah with that being said we know that there's going to be some payment involved for pre-alpha alpha beta pre-beta stuff like that all right now the last thing I want to touch on before I end the video is that uh, someone asked a question in the stream how are the Titans going to behave as far as abnormals they're trying to find out what activities can we see the titans doing inside of attack on titan freedom awaits now what they said is you can expect what they do in the show to do in attack on titan freedom awaits so what we have is there are sprinting abnormals there are going to be crawling abnormals um and i i'd assume there's probably going to be titans that are different heights um stuff like that because each size level can make a, a different a different difficulty you know what i mean so really we shouldn't expect something too crazy from the abnormals uh except they're gonna be really really tough probably big could be small i don't know but there's gonna be a different variations that can actually happen but with that being said hopefully you guys did enjoy if you did and you learned something new make sure to smash the like button and subscribe and your boys out thanks for listening